Now, before I start, I'd like to nominate someone to be my bodyguard for the things that Greg's not going to like me to hear. But on behalf of these newlyweds, I would like to thank everyone for making it out here. I know it was hard, maybe expensive for all of you to come. Uh, seems like we have people here from all over. Florida, California, Arizona, Idaho. Anyone here from New York? Uh, we even have one man here from Germany. What? But don't get excited, I think he just came for the free beer. <laughs> it is really nice to see so many of you came from so far. We all know how difficult and expensive it may have been. But well, we do it for these two on their special day. So thank you. Yay. I would also like to thank the parents for making this possible. I think we would have been somewhere, but not here tonight if it wasn't for them. So thank right. you to them. Thank you. Um, it doesn't seem like it, but I've known Brianne for about five years now. Uh, I think I'm supposed to tell the story of how we met, but honestly, I have no idea. So I asked Greg, Maybe he could remind me, but he had no idea either. Not surprising. So Greg asked Brienne how we met, but Brienne had no idea either. So I said we would just make it up, but he said I should leave that out of the speech. I said I'm going to just make it up anyway. But I think it was out on Whaley Lake. On one of the many days myself, along with many others, you know who you are would scam off Greg and go freeload off him on his time. I remember once he asked me if I would split a boat with him. Because after all, I'd be out there on a daily basis with him. But I was thinking to myself, why would I do that? I'll just continue to do what I'm doing. Let him pay for everything, right? We all miss those summer days. Greg was always good at getting people together. He was the only one that could convince everyone to do something. It's not surprising this is the first time since he's moved that I've seen everyone together again as a group. He has this power of persuasion to talk people into things. Eric, you can, you, you can attest to this. Just this past week, a day after I arrived, he talked my father and I into going on a mountain bike ride of one of the longest hill climbs in his area. A five mile brutal hill climb. Easy for him, but not us. But sure enough, he talked us into it. Or the time he talked me into helping him put a trailer hitch on his truck he had recently bought at the time. <laughs> Originally, I was apprehensive at first. For everyone that knows Greg, he was known to go through a few vehicles. Just a few. <laughs> but as always, he talked me into it. it. Took me all day, drilling, sanding, cutting on a hot summer day. All that work, and a week later he sold the truck. Go figure. <laughs> but looking back, that's the least I could do. For, I, I scammed all the boat usage I could that summer. <laughs> After we all met Brienne, we knew she was something special. Personally, I thought to myself, what's she doing with Greg? <laughs> <laughs> he wasn't always the most organized person. Years ago, I remember Hans and I going into Greg's rooms to look for something. It really didn't resemble a room, but it was. We saw about 30 cups, some filled with soda, juice, beer, most all had green mold and fungus growing from them. The smell of cigarette, pul cigarette smoke was repulsive. Hans and I looked at each other and Hans just said with his heavy accent, hey, maybe he wants to be a scientist. <laughs> what a change to now. This past week, my father and I got in trouble from Greg because we walked into Greg and Brianne's house without taking our shoes off. We can only break, we can only thank Brianne for this. For everyone that is familiar with Greg and I, you know we love to disagree. He would say white, I would say black. We've been like this since kids. But now we can agree on something, and that is that he asked Brianne to be his wife. And thankfully, she said yes. <laughs> I don't have time to talk about all the good qualities that Brianne has brought out in Greg. Personally, I never knew he had these qualities to begin with. But there is one thing she failed on, just a little. When Greg first told me he was dating a hairdresser, I thought she could fix a particular issue he was having. I think it's pretty obvious everyone knows what issue we are ha he's ha he's talk I'm talking about. It has something to do with this particular part of his body. Well, five years went by, it's even worse now than it was before. 
<laughs> Where's my body bag? <laughs> Again, I would like everyone, I uh, th thank everyone for coming. Uh, if everyone would please raise their glass. <laughs> this is to Greg and Brienne. Congratulations. Woo! And on a side note, Hans, I think, would like to say something at some point in time, but please be patient with him. Greg and I, after all, taught him how to speak English. <laughs> Congratulations. Yeah. 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 Yeah.